Now let us discuss about construct 4 by 16 decoder using 2 by 4 decoders. We know that 4 by 16 decoder has 4 inputs and it totally produces 16 outputs. So first let us see the truth table for the 4 by 16 decoder. So let the inputs are A, B, C, D. Uh, if the inputs are all zeros, then decoder produces D0 as the output. If the inputs are 3001, then D1 is the output. If the inputs are 0010, then D2 is the output. If the inputs are 0011, then D3 output line will be enabled. So D3 is the output. Okay. Next 0100 means D4, 0101 means D5, 0110 means D6, 0311 means D7. So likewise all ones means D15 is the output. So now let us, uh, uh, now we need to produce this 4 by 16 output with the help of uh, 2 by 4 decoders. So for that purpose totally we require 5 2 by 4 decoders. So this is the first 2 2 by 4 decoder. First to 2 by 4 decoder, we know that 2 by 4 decoder accepts 2 inputs and it produces 4 outputs. For the first to 2 by 4 decoder uh, and for all the 2 by 4 decoders, the inputs are C and D only. So the inputs are C and D. So C and D are nothing but input lines. So here what are CD? 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, 0, 1, 1. So CD, CD, CD is the output. Where is coming to the output? First to 2 by 4 decoder produces 4 outputs from D0 to D3. Second, D, uh, second 2 by 4 decoder produces outputs from D4 to D, D7. Next to 2 by 4 decoder produces outputs from D8 to D11. Next to 2 by 4 decoder produces outputs from D12 to D15. Here in order to enable the 2 by 4 decoder, we know that we must require enable input. We must require enable input. If the enable input is 0, then the corresponding decoder won't work. If the enable input is 1, then only the decoder will work. Okay. Uh, here, in order to enable the all these decoders, we are using one more decoder. So, this is one more decoder. So, this 2 by 4 decoder accept two inputs A and B. So, so, here what are A and B? So, for the first to 4, so all zeros, next to 4, 0 1s, next to 4, 1 0. Next to 4, all ones. Okay. So, A, B are nothing but here the first two bits. Uh, we know what is a 2 by 4 decoder. It accepts two inputs. So, let the inputs are 0, 0. So, 0, 0 means the 2 by 4 decoder produces first output. Here we are using the first output in order to enable the first 2 by 4 decoder. Next, if the inputs are 0, 1, then what will happen is the second output line will be activated. Here we are using the second output line in order to enable the second 2 by 4 decoder. Likewise, if the inputs are 1, 0, then it produces third output. The third output that is D2 will be enabled. So here we are using the third output line in, a, in order to enable this decoder. If the inputs are 1, 1, then the last output line we are using for enabling the 2 by 4 decoder, last 2 by 4 decoder. So now let's check whether our diagram is correct or not whether our diagram is, whether our logic circuit is producing this truth table or not. So let us assume that the inputs are 0, 0. Inputs are 0, 0. That means first 4, first 4. Here what are AB inputs? 0, 0 for the first 4 combinations. If the inputs are 0, 0, then what will happen? Then the first 2 output line will be enabled. So this enable, now this E value is 1, whereas this E value, this E value and this E value will become 0. At a time only one, one output will be enabled. Okay, next let us assume that here the inputs are 0, 0, 0. So 0, 0 means first output will be enabled. So D0 is the output. Let the inputs are 0, 1. Then the second output line D1. Let the inputs are 1, 0. Then D, D2 is the output. Let the input lines are 1, 1. Then, then D3 is the output. So here 0, 0 is the combination. 0, 0 means D0. 0, 1 means D1. 1, 0 means D2. 1, 1 means uh, D3. So, our first four are correct only. Now, let's check for the second combination. 0, 1. If the inputs are 0, 1, then what will happen? The second output line will be enabled. That means this E value is 1, whereas the remaining uh, uh, 3 values are 0. 
okay and let us see about this cd let we have applied for c 0 0 if cd are 0 0 then what will happen first output line what is the first output line d4 next if cd is 0 1 then the second output line d5 d5 1 0 means d6 third output line 1 1 means d7 so likewise it will it will produces the output let us check for one more combination uh, let the inputs are 1 0 so 1 0 means the third output line will be enabled so here we are using the third output line in order to enable the third 2 by 4 decoder so e value this e value is 1 whereas these e values are 0 so 1 0 1 0 if the inputs are 0 0 here then first output line d8 0 1 second output line d9 1 0 third output line d10 1 1 fourth output line d11 so this is about uh, construction of 4 by 16 decoder using 2 by 4 decoders so how many 2 by 4 decoders are required 4 2 by 4, 5 5 2 by 4 decoders so uh, 4 2 by 4 decoders in order to produce the outputs from d0 to d15 and we require one more 2 by 4 decoder in order to enable the all the 2 by 4 decoders